I think I lost my thumb. It's okay. It's on. Okay. We're, we're here again on the other side of 41st and Camby. This is an interesting story here. Where this site was used to be a gas station. Okay. This site over here behind it was developed. Now there was a, there was a height restriction on that development based on the fact it was next to a gas station. In other words, if everything bad happened at the gas station, they wanted to limit the height of the building. <laughs> So now the reverse of the story is the gas station's gone, and that building could have probably been built bigger, but that's what happens in between zoning applications. It's just a little mini anecdote here. So, okay, we'll just continue up the block. Now we're going to be on the east side of Canby, heading north. Uh, again, these uh, houses that are going to be coming down. Just to give you, a, just to give you a perspective. Like I say, these will all over time be gone. You can see the property stakes there. They're probably assembling, assembling the land as we speak. Many of the houses, you can be rest assured, are probably empty. Most of those houses we pass are empty or going to be sold? Well, you can, like, there's, a, there's a development application there. You can start yeah. seeing the land being assembled. Yeah. Little pockets. Oh, yeah. Once this starts, it has the snowball. One? Yeah, another one, yeah. Yeah, it's the snowball. How do they make yeah. offers to people to sell their house? So do you go hot and hold off for millions well, of dollars? Often, often what happens is there's people who live there a long time. They cannot afford the property taxes. And they get old. They live yeah. there for 50 years. They get old. They can't pay before the taxes. Okay, it's time to move out. So you're kind of forced out, not at gunpoint, but at the uh, it's kind of a <laughs> yeah, like kind of a, another scenario. We're in Queen Elizabeth Park now, Canby yeah. and 37th. But couldn't couldn't an old person hold out for another million bucks or something? How do they, oh, it's possible. How do they make these deals? On, it depends on how. I guess it just depends on your uh, what's what's your price, right? What's your yeah. price? Everybody has a price. Okay, we're coming up on more to construction here, eh? Yeah, this is one we drove by already, but again, this is what you're going to see is this. Uh, Big pits. So that pretty much covers the Canby area. Like I say, we are actually driving right over the um, the transit line. The transit line is below us here. It's like I said, this whole thing had been dug up uh, to depth I don't know about 50 feet, and there's an, actually we're over a tunnel that holds the. Uh, see, there's another development there. Is it coming in? Yeah. And again, there's that one on the corner they're coming up. It's Grayson. I think yeah. we already covered that, but now they're on the side. Yeah. Like I said, there's a, there's a fairly relatively new house, but I can guarantee you that one's going to be coming down. And if you look over the next block over this there. This one is coming down. Oh, I'm sure it will be. Yeah. If you look over nice there, house. you'll see two more development signs on the other arterial road there. Yeah. So that does candy for here. Okay, so we'll call that a wrap.